So we talked about kind of moody, depressed state, this one being more uh, anxious, uh, sorry, not depressed, but anxious state. So our adrenal tonic, the next question that we get is, well, why would you take this if this is really for that depressed state as opposed to the mood tonic, yeah? And I don't have a great answer for you other than the adrenal tonic is really aimed at depressive states from overuse of stress. Whereas the mood tonic is more like seasonal affective disorder, maybe classic depression, um, other other signs of, um, I guess, when you start thinking biochemically, you're thinking of serotonin imbalance, whereas really in a stress state, I'm not necessarily thinking serotonin imbalance. Uh, our mood tonic is St. John's wort. So because of that serotonin effect, it does act similar to an SSRI. It's really similar mechanism Y. So we do put a disclaimer on this that if you are taking SSRIs, which is a form of antidepressant that you should want to ask your physician before going on any uh, herbal regimen of St. John's wort. Uh, I love St. John's wort, and actually, I think it does more than just what SSRIs do. Uh, so I feel like it's a more well-rounded uh, herb. Uh, but again, we're looking at that serotonin component with St. John's wort, um, trying to increase mood over long periods of time. Uh, we put in lemon balm here. Uh, again, another nice calming herb. Uh, milky oats really for support here. Uh, I'm thinking nutritive support. Oftentimes in depressive states, we're thinking more on the deficiency side of things. So kind of adding some oomph to the to the blend here. Um, I love this blend. I think it tastes really good. It's really, really mild. Um, yeah, I I really, really love this blend. A lot of my patients who, especially when I was in Seattle, a lot of my patients suffering for what would be called seasonal affective disorder, normally I just tell them the month before it starts getting really like doom and gloom, like maybe starting to be in September, or October out here uh, in the Wenatchee Valley, I would take this every single day, anticipating that you know, come November, December, really into January and February is when I think people will really start feeling it out here. That would be a really appropriate time to take this. But you might just want to take this in general too. So I super love the mood tonic. I don't know if you can really see it. Oh, we're in my office, by the way. This is where all the magic happens. Um, I was going to say, I don't know if you can really see it, but you will get some settling of the milky oats on the bottom. So we do also tell people to just shake well before use.